<laughs> All right, here's a good question. Why can locking your knees cause you to pass out? Well, when you ask a good question, we give it to Matt. He tries to find a good answer every Friday for us. And well, this one kind of hits a little close to home. It doesn't. It, it doesn't need always good advice. I think don't do what Christina did. What? There's yeah, generally in life, good advice do not in life. Know. Right, yeah, right, exactly. Point, Matt. Yeah, chances point. are pretty good by now. You have seen the video. It's been all over the place. Two News reporter Gr Brooke Graham hitting the deck during a live shot a week ago. It prompted a lot of questions. You know, the biggest one is she okay? Yes. And why did she pass out in the first place? Did it have anything to do with her standing up straight, perhaps locking her knees? So I took that good question to the experts. already had the first fall on the skis. Two news reporter Brooke Graham unknowingly foreshadowing during this live promotion last Saturday. Her live report, which followed a few minutes later, was destined to become internet lore. And you guys are teaching me how to cross country ski, so give us some bags. Brooke is fine and the video was posted to YouTube where it has been seen close to 5 million times and has generated thousands of comments, prompting many to speculate that she passed out due to locked knees. Did she? It's a good question. <laughs> YouTube is certainly full of plenty of video evidence that keeping your legs perfectly straight can result in the need for a quick and sudden nap. Oh my God. In wedding parties tend to be regular victims. Here's a snapshot of who they are. As do military men and women standing at attention. I hope she's doing well. I asked Dr. Eric Smart of Alta View Hospital to weigh in on what happened to Brooke. He says that the most common cause of fainting? Decreased blood flow to the brain. And he says locking your knees can absolutely contribute to that, with gravity working against the body trying to pump blood to the brain. When you're standing up with your knees locked, then blood tends to want to pool in the lower extremities and it's a little more difficult to get it up to the, to the head and to the brain. If your knees are bent a little bit, the muscles of the legs contract and they act as a little bit of a pump to help facilitate getting blood out of the legs and up to the upper body and to the head. So give us some base. As for Brooke, she actually speculates that the decrease in blood flow to her brain had less to do with locking her knees and more to do with a cold that she's been fighting or perhaps the altitude. And she told me she does plan to talk to a doctor about it. So give us some base. Yeah, and Dr. Smart told me that fainting is rarely an emergency, but that if it does happen to you a few times, probably worth talking to your doctor about it. Thank you for the good question. If you have one, you can always reach me through kcb.com. <laughs> okay. All right, thanks, Matt.